This is Leonardo DiCaprio for the International Fund for Animal Welfare. Under One Sky, Why Animals Matter. We live in a truly remarkable world. What makes our Earth so special, so unique, is that it supports life. So far, we know of no other planet where life exists. Animals have inhabited the Earth's land, seas, and skies for hundreds of millions of years. Under one sky, an incredible diversity of animal life flourishes. There are about 1.8 million known species, and more are being discovered every day. More than half of the known species are insects, and only about 5,000 are mammals, like us. This incredible variety known as biodiversity makes up a remarkable web of life. What's more, if we take a closer look at the animal kingdom, we find that animals are truly incredible beings. Take for example the elephant, the largest land animal on earth. Elephants are social animals who form family groups with lifelong ties. They work together in caring for the young, defending the group, and gathering food. Zoologists also believe that elephants grieve. They congregate for hours around a dead member of their family and may revisit the graveyard many months later when just bones remain. Another giant, this one in the ocean, is the humpback whale who is a master at communication. The males can sing to each other across hundreds of miles of ocean. Other whales share a special talent called echolocation, using sound to navigate and find food. Animals can also heal themselves. Tigers, the biggest of all cats, have antiseptic saliva that helps clean their wounds. Hippos exude a special oil that works like sunblock on their skin to ensure they don't burn. Animals can do many things that mystify us. Geckos, for example, can hunt for their food upside down or on a ceiling. And if we take a look at the small hummingbirds, they can flap their wings at an astounding 200 beats per second. No human machine can get even close. If you look back in time and around you today, it's easy to see that animals have played important roles in our daily lives. They have been among our closest companions for thousands of years. Our fascination is evident from the earliest cave drawings to your favorite cartoon animal characters. Millions of people in every country of the world have pets from cats, dogs, and horses to rabbits and pigs. Among the first companion animals were wolves, used for hunting by prehistoric humans more than 10,000 years ago. As the partnership continued, wolves were domesticated and evolved into the dogs we know today. Now dogs are the only animals found in virtually every human society on this planet. The ancient Egyptians domesticated wild cats around 6,000 years ago, most likely to protect their grain stores from rodents. Cats thus became important to early agricultural societies just as dogs had been important to hunting cultures. Some companion animals provide more than just friendship. Animals including dogs, cats, and horses have also been recognized by health professions for their therapeutic effect. They relieve stress and help children overcome physical and emotional problems. Even though animals are a critical part of the web of life, our use of animals and resources has driven some species to the brink of extinction. Over several centuries, whales were hunted for their oil and other products. Even today, whaling in Japan, Norway, and Iceland continues to threaten these awe-inspiring species. Responsible whale watching is one way forward. This encourages appreciation and protection of whales while generating more than a billion dollars of annual income for coastal communities in 87 countries. Animals matter as essential components of ecosystems. From an anthill to the rainforest, ecosystems provide habitat that is just as important to animals as homes are to people. They provide essential food, 
shelter, migratory corridors, breeding, and nursery areas for animals of all kinds. Most animals are only adapted to live in one or two places. A whale that is adapted to live in the saltwater ocean could not live in fresh water. A polar bear could not live for long in the desert. Unfortunately, our ability to alter the environment more than any other living creature has greatly impacted the only planet we and all other species depend on for survival. In 2005, the Millennium Ecosystem Assessment, conducted by a team of 1,000 scientists, concluded that humans have altered the Earth's ecosystem more in the past 50 years than any other period in our history. As a result, biologists believe that we are now seeing species extinctions at 1,000 times the natural rate. Causes include pollution, hunting, overfishing, and habitat loss from developing land for agriculture, housing, or industry. And most scientists now agree that climate change is taking place in the world due to global warming caused by human activities. According to the results of a comprehensive scientific study conducted on four continents, climate change could cause the destruction of habitat ranging from coral reefs to mountain meadows and drive more than a million animals and plant species to extinction by 2050. This is one of the greatest threats animals will face in our lifetimes. Marine mammals are already feeling the heat. Global warming is now listed by the IUCN as the most significant threat to polar bears. Their Arctic sea ice is melting. One recent report concluded that two-thirds of polar bear populations could go extinct in the next 50 years. For the last decade, ice cover off Canada's east coast has been at its lowest for more than 30 years, with dire consequences for harp seals, who need the ice flows to give birth and nurse their pups. And these fascinating animals already face the largest marine mammal hunt in the world. We must face the fact that the most destructive animal in the world is us, human beings. Yet we also hold the key to changing our own behavior so that we can protect our living planet. For many decades, animal and environmental organizations like IFA the International Fund for Animal Welfare, have been leading the way in protecting animals and the environment. But all of us need to be a part of this crucial effort. Under one sky, all animals matter. Each are a critical part of the web of life. And what we humans do to protect animals and their habitats matters a great deal for the future of all beings on our blue planet.